had some you had some injury problems earlier in the year. How has your season been going and how how is it been on your project so far? Um, I mean, yeah, there's a couple bumps in the road along the way, but I mean it's a long year, stuff's gonna happen, so um I think the biggest thing was just stay positive and stay with it. And every day you are healthy and you come to the rink, try to become a better hockey player. How did you keep frustration away? Because you had a great opportunity in training camp had you been able to be in training camp to make this team. I mean, how do you keep the frustration away? You get hurt and you don't get the opportunity. Um, yeah, I mean, that was frustrating. But um, I think as a young guy, still a rookie, you realize, you know, you're not just skating in training camp. You're going to start down there. and. I mean, I was fine with it. I understood it and proved myself and proved myself and the organization that I should be back up here. That was my mindset basically the whole time. What happened in this game? You guys, I thought, were giving up very little. I mean, you guys had played a pretty good game up until maybe 10 minutes left in the third. Uh, what happened to turn it around, do you feel? Um, I mean, I don't think it was like one play or anything like that that turned the momentum, but um, just a couple of breakdowns, um, poor execution. Or not execution, but management. And, um, yeah, I mean, they capitalized on the chances they got. Anyone on Zoom? Go ahead, Lance. Hey, man, Jason here. Uh, how would you feel about you know your game today? And did you feel like you were able to basically transform going down in Rochester to you know to today? Uh, yeah, I mean, I think uh, the game maybe got off to a little bit of a slower start, so uh, had to try to get into that, um, but yeah, I mean, I don't think I, uh, wasn't my best game ever, but I was happy with the way I played today. Matias, there was that play in the second period, the puck looked like it was an easy tap in and you tied the guy up. Just just how important is that to do a lot of the little things as a young defenseman, be in the right spot and make plays that are big plays that maybe people don't notice right away? Uh, yeah, I mean, I feel like that's always been my style. I'm not a flashy player, obviously, that people notice the little things. But, um, yeah, I mean, that, that's my guy going in the net. And if they're going to attempt to pass it over there, i got to either, you know, get a body on him or get a piece of the puck. And, I mean, he still got it towards the net. Deller made a nice save. So, uh, yeah. Thank you. Maybe a, a different player than when we saw you four months ago, a better player over these, you know, the, these past four months? Uh, yeah, I mean, I think playing in Rochester to start the year, you definitely gained some confidence. Um, I was able to play in all situations there and uh, be a big part of that team. So whenever you do that in pro hockey, obviously the more you play and practice, uh, you'll become a better player. And I think, I mean, I'm, ob I'm obviously only still 21, so... I think I'm still developing and learning every day.